Hi everyone, my name is Father Sam Kachuba and welcome to Faith Friday. I want to talk to you today about one of my favorite saints, Saint Monica. Saint Monica is great because she prays. Monica is great because she's the mother of a saint herself. Monica is great because she's a good example of perseverance even when things seem impossible. See, her son, who is our diocesan patron, Saint Augustine, her son lived kind of a wild life, and you might know a little bit about Augustine. You can go, and he's kind of considered the bad boy of the ancient church. But Augustine had, had lived this life, and no matter how often Monica invited him to come to faith in Jesus Christ, and no matter what her example was, he was always refusing and always pushing it off. And so Monica just continued to pray for him. She persevered in that deep prayer for his conversion. She desperately wanted him to go to heaven. And isn't that the desire of every single Christian mother? They want their child to go to heaven. Isn't that the desire of every parent? They want what's best for their child. And she knew that what was best for her son, Augustine, was a relationship with Jesus Christ. So Augustine goes off to study. He's trying to get far away from Monica. So he goes to Milan and Monica follows him. And there in Milan, she finds this guy named St. Ambrose, and she asks Ambrose for help. And so between Ambrose and Monica, you've got all this prayer, all this study, and all this good example being offered to Augustine. And finally, Augustine comes to believe. He comes to say yes to faith, and he becomes not only a Catholic, but he goes on to become a great saint. He's a bishop. He's a great preacher and teacher of the faith. He's one of the greatest theologians and philosophers in the whole history of the church. And it was Monica who prayed him to that point. Monica teaches us by her tears, by her perseverance, that we need to keep going. Even when things seem most difficult, even when it seems like people are running away just to get away from us, keep praying. We all have that experience in our own lives, in our own families even, of people who we want to see happy. We want to see them succeed. We want to see them do well. Very often we want to see people come back to faith, come back to Jesus Christ. So who should we turn to? Monica gives us a great example of not only what we should do, but she also gives us a wonderful intercessor. So we can turn to St. Monica and ask for her prayers, along with ours, for those members of our family or for those friends of ours who are, are far from the church, those people who have started to lose their faith or who are struggling in the midst of something going on in their lives. We turn to St. Monica and we ask for her intercession, that they would come to faith, that our example would be a help in that, and that by our prayer and by her prayers, we would all, like St. Augustine, come to embrace the beauty of a relationship with Jesus Christ. God bless you.